All right, I got the king quad fixed, uh, mostly fixed and working. Differential back in her and stuff like that. Um, I'm going to work on the Bayou. You remember the old Bayou? I worked on that one before. I got the uh, engine and everything up running on her. Uh, she's working real nice now. Um, we did the rings. Put her back together again. She worked nice for about a second. Cut out, no power. Valve was bent. Replaced the valve after I did such a nice job lapping it. But that's when I discovered that little spot. See it? That little wide, a little bit extra wide. And that's what gave me the clue that it was bent. So fix that. Um, put the new rings in her. All said and done. She uh Make a liar out of me now. Ah, hang on. Oh, come on. Oh, I had the gas turned off. That's why. Anyway, she starts real nice, goes real strong. Uh, so, today I'm going to build a front rack. So, I'm getting that. I'm going to build a front rack for her. I want to build one something similar to this. i use some little square stock I got there and everything. Uh, so i got the fixed lights and a battery on this one. But I'm going to use this as my pattern. Try to build something for the front of this one. And uh, I got this old camera. I'll use that on the tripod to try to keep you up to date as I'm going through with this right down over the next little bit. Um, so the quality is a little bit poorer with that one. But anyway, he's got a tripod. Uh, let's get building. Sometimes I feel like a great big bowl of chopped liver Sitting on the table, waiting to be had That's fucking sad, cause no one likes chopped liver And I feel bad I don't want to be chopped liver I don't want to be chopped liver I don't want to be chopped liver But I feel like it Bad thing about chopped liver Doesn't make good sandwiches Doesn't make good snacks In fact it's kind of nasty that's how I feel sometimes, old and nasty, like a bowl of chopped liver. I don't want to be chopped liver. I don't want to be chopped liver. I don't want to be chopped liver, but I feel like it. Chopped liver doesn't go with much like potato salad, fried chicken and other picnic stuff. It just kind of sits there, laying on a tray and gets passed over for better things like ham and cheese and such. Cause I don't want to be chopped liver. I don't want to be chopped liver. I don't want to be chopped liver, but I feel like it. I don't ever want to be chopped liver, must be kind of lonely. Can't make any friends cause you smell bad. And just sit there on the refrigerator shelf and grow old. And no one will ever eats you, so they put you in the trash And they set you on the curb, all alone and by yourself And the trashman comes and gets you, and you wind up in the dumps And that's not the kind of place that I really want to be So I think that I'll just go on home and watch some TV But the TV set is broken, and I think that really sucks and I've carried this on way too long, and you probably think I'm nuts. 
Cause I don't want to be chopped liver I don't want to be chopped liver I don't want to be chopped liver But I feel like it I don't want to be chopped liver No, I don't want to be chopped liver anymore Cause I don't want to be chopped liver But I feel like it Sometimes I feel like a great big bowl of chopped liver Sitting on the table Waiting to be had That's fucking sad Cause no one likes chopped liver And I feel bad Here's a pubic hair on this snow blue pad Fucking <laughs> It'll be a hard time tonight In Old Waco, Texas At the FBI barbecue Yes, the people are saying What a terrible loss So let's roll back the tanks And pass me the sauce We'll light up the sky In Old Waco, Texas The cooks will know just what to Delta Force or Branch Davidian We can all read from our Gideon At the FBI Barbecue Yes, it's a beautiful sight In Old Waco, Texas With the Army and the NRA Let's bang some Davidians So what is all this fuss? They're Americans to you But they're the enemy to us So let's all sing and shout In Old Waco, Texas We'll stop to have a prayer or two We can drown out all the cries As we practice telling lies At the FBI barbecue Yes, we'll enjoy ourselves in Old Waco, Texas, at the FBI barbecue. We can all toss our grenades at the beautiful fire and watch the agents dance around the funeral pyre. So y'all come on down to Old Waco, Texas, and we can crack a beer or two. So if you want to have some fun, we can all shout, well done, at the FBI barbecue. Exploit the media at the FBI barbecue. Invite the president at the FBI barbecue. Let's make a movie at the FBI barbecue. Don't tell Janet Reno. There's an FBI barbecue. When I was in my teenage years, I did just what I should. I listened to my mother and I was kind and sweet and good and my friends and I did rituals and I prayed with all my might that this would be the evening that she'd stop along her flight well that was several years ago and that chick's long overdue and it's time I came to terms with something plainly clear to you the boob fairy never came for me no, the boob fairy never came for me. Okay, I'm spunky, and I'm cute, and I've got a great personality. The boob fairy never came for me. Well, we were the third house on a country drive. I thought, maybe she just got lost. So I hung my bra on the mailbox till the neighbors took it off. And all my friends got visits and expanded through the years And left me wailing to the gods buying training bras at Sears Still I harbor hopes she'll come for me, I know she will I get them 
done myself if she'd agree to foot the bill. The boop fairy never came for me. No, the boop fairy never came for me. Look, I wasn't wanting melons, just a cute curvaceous bee. But the boop fairy never came for me. This isn't a song about boobs, not really. The boobs are just a set of metaphors to symbolize everyone's fear of human inadequacy. Hey, we've all felt the pain of being dissed by one fairy or another. So during the next refrain, I want you to join in with me with your own fairy that never paid a call. Maybe it's the height fairy or the butt nymph. Men, maybe it's the pectoral or hair fairy. Or maybe some other fairy you just want to mumble about. Look, nobody's going to ask you to enunciate. And sisters, I don't want you feeling alienated right now because you happen to be full-figured. Just change the line to the boob fairy just wouldn't let me be or the boob fairy became obsessed with me. Okay, here comes the refrain. Everybody, join in. The boob fairy never came for me. No, the boob fairy never came for me. Though the hip fairy came two times and the thigh fairy came three. The boob fairy never came for me. That boob fairy never came for me. Now, I've just finished welding this, welding it all back together again. I thought this was long enough, but I need to add this little piece right in there. So it didn't take long. I need some more of this flat bar now. I'll put a few flat bars down through here. That'll be my front rack. Paint it up. Well, I saw him in Red River, that's where he got his start With all the other actors overseas he got the part The way that he walks, the way that he draws You'd swear he had grit and you'd swear he had blood He lied about the football, he was strictly second string He wore a lot of makeup and his name was Marion American manhood would never be the same But here's a little secret about the late John Wayne John Wayne was a thespian John Wayne was a thespian yeah, Warden Dirty Harry and Cool Hand Luke They say John Wayne was a really butch duke John Wayne was a thespian John Wayne was a thespian Yeah, he wore a bandana, had a thing for a horse The explanation is he was a thespian, of course An American hero Brave and true, he defeated the Nazis and the Japanese too Got the Cherokee at noon, the Apache at dawn And with the USO he did a tour of Vietnam But underneath it all, he led a double life He never served his country, he stayed home and beat his wife The Freudians say he shot his father's gun The semi wonder if he really had one Cause John Wayne was a thespian John Wayne was a thespian yeah, more than Kirk Douglas and his son Mike They say John Wayne was a really butch duke John Wayne was a thespian John Wayne was a thespian Yeah, he wore a bandana, had a thing for a horse The explanation is he was a thespian, of course Just like Jodie Foster Just like Anne Hesch Just like Rosie O'Donnell and Ellen DeGeneres John Wayne was a thespian John Wayne was a thespian Yeah, he wore a lot of makeup His name was Marion He put the ma back in macho He's a thespian Hello, welcome
to One Way Kitchen. I take your order, please. I highly recommend the combo number five. Oh, nice. Yeah. Combo one, two, three, four, five. Everybody love a Chinese female fry from the Chinese restaurant around the corner. So you say you want some wonton soup. I bring your order. Roast duck is a special all this week. We buy a deep feed because our duck is cheap. You like egg for young, diced chicken, chow fun and tongue We are serving dim sum, all of it yum yum. So what can I get you really big on that pork? We got the chopsticks, but please use our fork. Everything is fried, it's so good, like a dumpling. So just give us a ring. A little beef and broccoli, you got to try. A little mixed vegetable and white rice. A little sweet and sour is all you need. A little bit of salt and no MSG. A little bit of general toast chicken. A little bit of romaine, I can't stand. A little bit of Sichuan or Hunan. A little bit of Mugugai Pa. Now, just paint it up. That is done.